It's prime weather for a walk outside, but many of you are seeing a growing problem on your local trails. The Fox 5 drone showing us those who are homeless camping along the walkways or under bridges or even right in the middle of a path. This is for miles along the Flamingo Arroyo Trail. County officials say there's work being done to clear these public rights of ways, but social workers say they also have the tough job convincing those who are living there to get off the streets. Increasing presence of folks who are homeless throughout the valley. The Flamingo Arroyo Trail spans miles across Clark County. Those in the East Valley are concerned about what they encounter if they walk, jog, or bike. Homeless camps on trails or bridges blocking the right of way. County officials say there's work being done first to clear pathways for everyone. And we're not going to let people live in the bridges. That's just not acceptable. But we have to keep those bridges and those trails open for everybody else. Those encampments tend to grow. We do reach out, we do make contact, start that rapport building. We don't have the authority to uh, to make them move. The other half of tackling the homeless problem is helping those in need leave the streets. Clark County Social Services and social workers with care teams go out and stage interventions. It's difficult to get folks who are living out on the streets into care. Effort to get them housed sometimes can take 10, 12 different interventions. Reynoso explains every person's reason for being unhoused is different. From worries about their stuff or losing a pet, social workers have to answer their concerns about leaving a camp and offer a better solution. Once someone agrees to get help, they get temporary housing, substance abuse help, or mental health care. Reynoso says what you see here is happening all across the Valley's suburbs. It's the aftermath of an economic crisis. One paycheck away from ending up out on the streets or without a roof over their heads. There's a huge eviction crisis right now. A lot of people who are pending eviction, people always coming from other areas. And there's other work underway to get more beds for the homeless quickly. There's a motel along Boulder Highway that's being converted into temporary housing.